All right, girl. Okay. You're all right. Okay, Tara. <laughs> Face me. Okay. Put your hands up like this. Turn like this. You can keep that. Put them in your mouth. Go open around so I can see all your teeth. No, no, I want to see your teeth. Tara was brought in tonight by Sandy Police. Apparently, she was upset. She was found in a movie theater, throwing her shoes at the building. We're going to have to keep a close eye on her because her moods seem to change up and down. Tara, you're going to be good for me, right? Absolutely. All right, that's what I thought. Come on over, Tara. Turn and face that man, OK? Yep. Do you have anything on you that could stick to ever poke me? No, ma'am. Any knives, needles, no, guns, drugs, weapons? No. Listen, listen to me, please. So you know what you're answering, all right? Yes, ma'am. if I find it, that's enhanced charges, OK? Do you think? Knives, needles, I don't. guns, drugs, weapons? I don't. Do you have any body piercings? Nipples, belly button, hood, Body piercings? Tongue? Yes, on this ear. Over here. OK. Anything that I can't see? No, ma'am. All right, Tara. Did you have anything to drink tonight? I did. What did you drink? I had gin, and I'm 21 so years did old. That... I can understand, especially why those two officers right there in the car would assume that I'm an aggressive person, because I am. <laughs> Who isn't? Huh? There you go. All right, Tara. So far, so good. Let's continue on, OK? Let's take. Are you starting to cry now? We got your handcuffs off. Don't start crying. I'm not. OK, <laughs> take off this purple shirt, please. Okay, put your hands back up on the mat. You're all right. All right. Go ahead and bend over and peel off your socks for me, please. Can you peel? You might want to. OK, stand up. Let me help you. Let me help you. You're OK. You got it? <laughs> All right, stand up. <laughs> Put your hands back up here. Hands on the mat. All right, Tara, you're doing great. We're almost done. It's OK, just relax. <laughs> breathe. Just, just breathe. Let's get ear those out. earrings out, OK? You kind of put the glove over. I just put my hands up for a second. That's OK, um, just keep working on that. <laughs> no, this one is not, um, it's just kind of it does not come out very well, actually. None of them do, do they? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I feel like they kind of give you the person. Turn this way first. All right, girl. Okay. You're all right. OK, Tara. Okay. Face me. Okay. Put your hands up like this. Turn them like this. Pinkies up. Put them in your mouth. Go open around so I can see all your teeth. No, no, I want to see your teeth. You're OK. Down so I can see your teeth. I see all your gums and stuff down. Go down. OK, open wide. Open. Say, ah. ah. Perfect. OK, bring it. Lean over. Why are you holding on to that? Just relax. I'm not Bend at your waist. OK, stand up. Let's go inside. There you go. All right, you're going to be OK, okay. Tara. Thank you. We're going to leave her in here for a little while till she sobers up, calms down, and she's not quite coherent and understanding the full totality of her visit here to the jail. We'll give her a few hours sober up, then we'll try and get her through the process here. I checked on prisoner. We put her in here earlier for intox and just odd behavior. And she's just been really emotional. Tara, how you doing? You feeling any better? Yeah, you feel like you can get through the process? Get fingerprinted, photographed? Yes. OK, come on up here. Stand with your back right there. Then she's going to check you out, OK? Are you hurt anyway? Yes, on my wrist. From the handcuffs? Yes. Can you put your finger in here? We'll check out your wrist here just now. So it should be sense. fine. Are you hurt anywhere else inside your wrist? Not that I'm aware of. After speaking with our mental health staff, as well as our medical staff, it's apparent that after a couple of hours, she was able to sober up. Her emotional state has become much, much more stable. And now it looks like she's ready to go through the booking process. So our job now is to move her through the system and get her going through the process as quick as we can. And the doors open up and they leave me outside. I'm going to go home to my family tonight. I've been thinking about my home. I've been thinking about my knees.